Hey guys, welcome back to the MLB The Show 24 Red Sox franchise mode. Today, starting off with the second game of the three-game series against Pittsburgh Pirates so far. We're 16-5. and five. I believe we are on a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 game winning streak. And what a way to start this season, to be honest. But uh, for us, when you look at the standings right now, we're currently at the top of the AL East. And uh, in Rays, they're currently 2.5 games behind us. And to be honest, I'm a little bit surprised that Yankees and Orioles are not doing as good as I thought they would be. But to be honest, when you look at our overall ranking, we don't, well, I don't want to say we don't deserve to be up top, but definitely doesn't quite reflect on what we actually do. Pitching wise, we are definitely one of the best team out there. Offensively, we are, you know, we, we're still catching up. How about that? Uh, but today, uh, we're going to be facing against a right-handed pitcher, Mitch Keller, with an ERA of 3.46, which means I'll be making a lot of, uh, well, I mean, a couple of substitutions. The Braves definitely coming on, like I always says. And uh, let's see, is there anybody else that I should replace? I'm sure Trevor Story might need a date off here. Um, Trevor Story, O'Neal, I think this might be, I think this might be good. Let's see. Yeah, it looks like, yeah, it looks like uh, Trevor Story needs a break. But mm, at this point, maybe Rafael. Yeah, Rafael will be batting seven, playing as a shortstop today. So this is the lineup I'm going for: Duran, Devers, Cassis, Yoshida, Abreu, O'Neill, Rafael, Valdez, and also McGuire. And here is Mitch Keller looking for his second win of the season with an ERA of a 3.46, making his fifth game appearance of the season and here comes the first pitch to Jaron Duran one two count and it is going to be a lazy fly ball to left field Reynolds is right there one out three two count to Devers and that is going to be a high chopper one hopper to Rowdy Telez 42nd out oh two count to Cassis and he swung it out one, a one, two, three inning for Mitch Keller. That was a very good pitch. It was a cutter at the uh, at the shin area. And here comes Dick Pafetta picking up the ball. Apparently right now he has the highest ERA compared to any other starting pitchers in the Red Sox rotation. But he's looking for a bounce back today and looking for his third win of the season. 0-2 count to Hayes. And that is a beautiful slider to set him down for the first out. And here comes a chopper to Rafaela. And he is going to get Andrew McCutcheon out at first for the second out. And here comes a ground ball. Rafaela, it's been very busy for him in the first inning, but he got Brian Reynolds out there. 3-2 count. And here comes a line drive. Base hit down the middle, and Yoshida got on base with the leadoff single. And ground ball, base hit to left field, but I'm going to just uh, hold the runners on first and second. William Abreu with another single back-to-back -back base hit to start off this inning. 2-2 Two -two count. And that is a very good cutter. Right outside, that will be the first K for Mitch Keller. Line drive, base hit to left center field, and Yoshida's going to score all the way from second base, and the Brea offenses to third base. And meanwhile, Rafaela with an RBI single. We have taken the 1 0 lead here. 1 2. And here comes a fly ball to center field. Surely it is going to be deep enough to score at least a run here. Tagging by both runners, and Rafaela got there to third base. While Emmanuel Valdez got himself an RBI sack fly. Fly ball to left field straight at Brian Reynolds. But there you go. Top of the second. We are taking a 2-0 lead. That's a line drive over the top of Devers' head. And surely that is a single for O'Neal. 0-1. Oh, and here comes another base hit, back-to-back -back base hit for the Pirates to start off this inning. We might be in trouble. 1-2. And Telez went down swinging. That is a perfect 12-6 curveball. Second K for Pafetta, and that will be the first out of the inning. 2-2. Two -two. 
And that's a high fly ball to left field. O'Neill is going to be right under it, but we're not sure if O'Neill Cruz is going to attack and run. But no, the runner stays in their bases, and right now it remains two outs. High fly ball to left center field. Connor Joe hits that one tons, but Duran's right under it to make a great running catch. One, two. And Duran, fly ball. To left field, Brian Reynolds, it's out there today for the first out. High fly ball, and surely it is going to be caught right there, right on the line. The second baseman's there to make the catch, two outs. And line drive down the middle, but O'Neill Cruz is right there to make the catch, make the throw. One, two, three, inning for Keller. And a ground ball this time. Johnson ground out to Cassis for the first out. That's a ground ball again. And Valdez is right there to make the catch. Two out. 0-2 count to Andrew McCutcheon. And that is going to be another ground ball. Three straight ground balls in this inning. And 1-2-3 inning for Nick Pavetta. And here comes a line drive to left field, but another fly out to Brian Reynolds. He has been really busy out there. 0-2. And strikes out looking by Abreu. That's a very good ball there. And there's a ground ball. Is it going to be a base hit? What a jump throw. And that is going to be an out. That's a bam bam play at home. What a play by O'Neill Cruz. To throw Tyler O'Neill out at first. One, two count. And that's a very good cutter. Certainly, it got Brian Reynolds swinging. That would be the third K. One, two. To Cruz. And this time, it jammed him with just a little bit. Raffaella with a good throw. Two out. Ground ball. Another one. Three straight ground balls. No, actually, two straight ground balls today. But again, a lot of ground balls in general. The ground ball, base hit down the middle. And Raffaella got himself his second base hit of the day. A line drive to right field. Surely it is going to be dropped. And that is surely going to be a double. While Sedan uh, Raffaella is going to stay at third right now. Back-to-back uh, -back base of Valdez with the double. This guy seems to be on fire right now. Man on second and third with no out. And here comes Reese McGuire. And a pop-up. Oh, my God. What have I done? What have I done to myself? Pop-up. That's the first out. 2-1. And that is going to be a popped up to center field. And Rafael is going to run. Oh my god, that was a close play at home. And turns out that will be a sack fly to Jaron Durant. Doesn't seem to be enough to be a sack fly. But Rafael got wheels at third. And right now we have extended the lead here to 3 nothing. And Devers delivers to... Right center field, it is going to be dropped in front of the wall. And uh, another run being scored, an RBI double by Devers, and we have stretched the lead to 4 nothing. That is it for Mitch Keller, who hasn't been amazing today. But here comes Johan Oviado, who will be making his 8th appearance of the season with an area of a 4.20. 2-2. That's a good pitch. That's a good sinker. Ground ball to Cassis. Another ground ball today. I think I think at least there are 10 batters for the Pirates who has grounded into uh, a ground out in any form. 0-2 count to Davis. And another ground ball to Cassis. Bobbled just a little bit. And he is able to recover it with Pafetta being very smart. Running down that baseline. Running down to first base making sure everybody got a cover and here comes Connor Joel. 0-2 and another ground ball to Valdez the 1-2-3 inning for Nick Perfetta he is done for the day 
ground ball. And O'Neal Cruz, can he get Yoshida out of the first this time? No, he can. He has produced two amazing plays so far in this game. But finally, we're able to beat him with an infield single. Yoshida, hard hit ball to O'Neal's, or not O'Neal's, Cruz. His uh, backhand of play, but Yoshida just did well enough to beat that throw. Another ground ball this time. Four, six, and that is going to be a fielder's choice for his doubt. One out. One, two count. A breeze gonna run, regardless. Oh my god, that was horrible. And a breeze is out. Strikes him out, throw him out. A double play for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Bernardino is going to replace Nick Pavetta in this inning. He has an ERA of 4.26. Last time out, he had a pretty good inning. 0-2 count. Bernardino, can he get Johnson out? Yes, he can. Check swing. He went over to play for the first out. Hayes ground ball. Oh, wow. What a snatch by Cassis. I couldn't really tell whether it's going to be fair or foul. But Cassis has been really busy at first. 1-1. One, one. And it's going to be a ground ball, but it eats him up a little bit. Rafaela, oh, that was unfortunate to be honest. It is going to be an infield single. 0-2. Oh, and Brian Warano ran down swinging. Drop third strike, but there you go. Two Ks for Benandino. It's a very good outing by him. 0-2. Oh, and another ground ball this time. Wow, perfect, perfect. I think it's my first time in this series so far where we actually get a perfect perfect contact Rafael is going to run here and we haven't had a lot of base running going on that's a good that was a poor jump but Rafael just got there and that would be the second stolen oh first stolen base for him holy crap by the way we have the worst stolen bases record so far in the league that was our fourth one of the year and another line drive this time Surely, Rafael is going to score from second base. And that would be the second base hit. Is that a double? Could be a double. A second base hit for Valdez. This guy is really on fire right now. 1-1. One, one. A line drive to left center field. And Reese McGuire half a bit of himself. Or half some fun of himself right there. Six runs are being scored, and we have extended the lead here. Six nothing after an RBI single by McGuire. And there you go. Another line drive to center field. Is it going to be dropped? Yes, it will. Another base hit. Four base hit in a row to start off this inning. Top of the seventh already. Six to nothing, and I reckon they are going to the bullpen. Josh Fleming will be coming on to make his third appearance of the season. And again, this is a great matchup. A left-handed batter against a left-handed pitcher. Let's see who's going to win. 2-2. Two, two. That is going to be a ground ball. 5-4-3 double play. It looks like Raphael Devers has lost this battle. And the ground ball to the middle. Cruz with another diving play. Wow. Cassis was about to enter his 12 for 13 game hitting streak, but it was snatched away by Cruz. 0-2. And that will be the third K for Bernardino. A very good curveball to get Cruz out swinging. Ground ball. Devers. 5-3 put out, and he just cannoned this one over the top of Cassis. We might be in a bit of trouble if uh, we don't be a little bit careful defensively. 1-2 count this time. And Telez hits a ground ball. 5-4-3 double play. That's a very good play again by Rafael Devers. And that is done for Bernardino. Ground ball to the second baseman there. Johnson's going to retire. Yoshida out. And another one. Another chopper to the second baseman. Off balance throw for the second out. 1-2. A ground ball this time. Oh, through the gloves of Telez. And O'Neill got himself a base hit. Finally. Finally, he got a base hit here. 2 2. 
And wow, finally it retires Rafaela. Took them three at bats to strike him out there. Isaiah Campbell will be coming on right here, making his ninth appearance of the season with an ERA of a 1.5. 1 2. And that will be a pop up to Cassis. He is right under it this time. Ground ball, fly ball popped up. Just call Cassis. He'll be right there. That will be the first out. 0 2 count to Connor Joe. Swung it out one. That's a very ugly swing. Uh, first K for Isaiah Campbell and two outs right here. 0 2 to Johnson. And this one, another popped up. Second one in this inning. Devers right under it. A 1 2 3 inning by Campbell. Ground ball again to Valdez. Chopper. And it is going to be a good throw by the third baseman. One out. 1 2 count. McGuire fly this one to left field. It is going to be another great catch by Reynolds. Line drive to right field straight at Andrew McCutcheon. A 1-2-3 inning by Borowski. For the final three outs, Chase Anderson will be making an appearance. Making his fourth appearance of the season. Fly ball, Abreu hesitated just a little bit, but made to routine catch, one out. One, two count. And that is going to be a line drive to left field. Can O'Neill get there? Yes, he can. Two out. Ground ball, and there you go. A one, two, three inning by Chase Anderson, and we have won this series. Two and nothing, but today we have beaten the Pittsburgh Pirates six and nothing it's a relatively easy game to play a very relaxing one to play to be honest offensively we are cruising and also nick pavetta a special shout out for him who has been amazing uh fresh fresh air fresh air in this game but there you go he's a player of the game he pitched five innings allowing two hits only but striking out three mitch keller will be taking a loss and emmanuel faldez you gotta give all the credits to him and also rafaela both of them are producing magical moments at the seven and eight spot so there you go thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video like this video subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in a bit